Look, the mulberries are ripening. It's mulberry time. The first mulberries of this year's season. Oh, look. There's one. Hicks Fancy, I think it is. Mmm. That's nice. Mmm. Yummy. I think King James the first planted mulberries all around England for this. He's planted over a hundred thousand of them for the silkworm industry. And it never caught up in Britain, the silkworm industry. But uh, some of those trees that he planted are still growing there today, but this isn't one of those trees. I'm in Australia. Mmm, yummy. And the birds love these as well. So it's important to grow something for the birds. Blackbirds. Look at that, isn't it fantastic? Beautiful fresh fruit rich in antioxidants and vitamin C and everything. Hmm. Look, there's more. Aren't I wealthy in mulberries? Why don't councils grow mulberry trees all along the streets for everyone to enjoy? They ought to. If they don't, there must be a reason. It might be that someone wants to keep the food locked up so people have to pay for it. Mightn't that be the case? That might be the case, mightn't it? But I've got plenty of mulberries and I've got more than one mulberry tree. I've got about three, I think. Yes, I think I've got about three. I should grow more, shouldn't I? Mmm. Mulberries are really nice if you sweat them in a saucepan dry. Then sort of just move the saucepan gently on the stove. And uh, just keep shaking the saucepan up and down and sweat them on the heat. A low, gentle heat. And then all the, the juice comes out of them. And you can strain off the fruit part, which isn't so nice. And then you can just make it into a lovely cordial by adding some sugar to it. Oh, I'm so lucky. I'm so, oh look, there's just uh, so many of them. Mmm, yummy. I can stand here and do this all day. Some people just watch a person on YouTube eating mulberries instead of having their own mulberry tree. I wonder why that is. Oh, look at the shade. Look at the shade of a mulberry tree. Look at it. Isn't it fantastic? Very fast growing trees. Mm, the ones in the shade aren't ripe yet. The ones in the sun. Look, these ones are all green. That means that I can have more in a week or so, doesn't it? It means my season of mulberries can be extended. You need mulberries, true, too. Yes, you do. Everyone needs mulberries. You ought to have them. You can make them into, into jam, into drinks. You can't use them exactly the same as a raspberry because once you, once you cro cross, crush them, you don't really want the, uh, the squashed part. The juice is the nicest. Or you can keep silkworms. Yes, silkworms. Mulberry wine. Lovely.